here in person and um, we just, I, we trade uh, fairly often and I'm so excited because she has a lot of grail items for me. Like for instance, this is the Smushy Mushy Green Tea Taiyaki, which nobody has seen ever. And these are like, it's the Rare Chase one. I don't think I've ever seen anybody with it and I'm so excited about this. I forget all the items that she grails for me because she's one of the best toy mules ever and like such a wonderful lady. Here's, oh my God, look at this little pushy noodles. It's like a little Asian noodle box. I hear that these noodle boxes are supposed to open flat like a plate um, so that you can eat them like a plate, like on a plate, but I've never done it that way. Um, and then I have, ah, Toki Doki Patrick. <laughs> this is the Toki Doki SpongeBob collab. And here is Patrick Star. And he is with a floaty. And the back of the floaty is the Biscatini head. Um, somebody correct me if it's not Biscatini, but I'm pretty sure it's Biscatini because I'm a little bit into Toki Doki. And the second I say that now, like a bunch of Toki Doki fans are gonna be like, how dare you get that name wrong? You don't even know any of the Toki Dokis. But I think it's either Biscotti or Biscatini. <laughs> There's a girl and a boy one. Um, and these, oh, I'm so obsessed with these. These are the FX, Sensory FX pods. They're the ASMR pods and they're fidget toys. Oh, this is so satisfying. Listen to that. This one spins. And they're just fidget toys. And they're the kind of fidget toys that I really like because they're a good size. They fit perfectly in your palm. This is so satisfying. I cannot with how amazingly satisfying this is. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, this is the next one, which I think spins. Oh, God, the satisfaction of the noise. Do it one-handed. Yeah, I would just all day. Sounds like crickets. Okay, and then here it looks like another spinning one. What does this do? Oh, this is so fidgety. It's like a button. These are cool. I love these so much. I really super excited excited about these fidgety fidget toys because I'm um I'm an anxious person I have a lot of anxiety and it helps to get rid of energy so it's oh how fun it's a little bunny bean plush I don't know what these are called but they're so cute it's got a little sakura bottle uh, uh flower right here sakura blossom that's what I was gonna say and little sakura blossoms I Maggie I'm having like a lot of happiness right now Okay, so here's a bag of num noms, which I'm just, I cannot even. And the only, like, the only thing that we're supposed to trade in this box is this celery. <laughs> like, that's the only num num I cared about. And she gave me two of these celeries. I love sweet things, but the savory num noms are so cute. So I really wanted celery. This is so cute. I almost want to wear it like earring. I don't have both my ears pierced, but I think this would make amazing earrings. Um, I only have one ear pierced like a crazy person. <gasps> and she gave me another grail item. It's the saltine num num. I've never seen this in person. I don't even know anybody who has this except maybe Amanda. Oh, it smells weird and savory. <laughs> I love when toy companies try to make savory smells. These are all savory. I cannot even. Here's a french fry. Is it getting too difficult to hold? Here's a little french fried giraffe. And this is a giraffe pretzel stick. So adorable. And here is another grail item for me. The flippin' sausage. It's so sweet, like num nums are so cute. And this one's all like a squishy rubber, which is not like the rest of their textured items, but it's not a squishy like um like this one is a foam squishy it's betty baguette which i'm so excited to have <gasps> it's betty baguette maggie i'm like gonna you're you've got something coming your way sweetheart 
Um, here's a cheese, a sliced cheese that goes perfect with my saltine. Oh my goodness, I never thought I'd see this set. <gasps> I cannot, I cannot, I cannot, I cannot. And the celery is so perfect. Um, here I have a blue corn tortilla chip with a mustache. This one's a rare and he's got a nacho cheese up on him. Um, I will do like a num noms thing uh, one day, my entire num noms collection. It'll be like an hour long video of just me looking at all my num noms. Here's a baby pea and a little strawberry. This is the season two strawberry. The season one strawberry is pinker and they're the same mold. I think the strawberries are one of the only ones that are like that. <gasps> Here's a winking candle, a little birthday candle that's winking. And then I don't have this one and I've never touched it before. I'm so excited to see this. It's a crinkle cut fry. And I don't like, I love crinkle cut fries with a passion. I'm the person in school that really liked them when everybody else was ordering, um, like, I don't know, steak fries. Do you like crinkle cut fries, honey? Nope. You don't like crinkle cut fries? Regular fries, man. Regular fries um, are not greater than crinkle not cut even, fries. Really thick ones either. Not the thick ones, just like. Not steak fries. Just, just regular like regular fries. french fries, like really thin french fries. No. Okay. Um, God, there's so much continuing. <gasps> it's a Gabby toy! Loin Fruit is really into Gabby, and so she's, um, she's, oh, it's Baby Box! All right, I gotta open this right now. So this is the Gabby toy. It comes in the Gabby's dollhouse. And here is the menu, which is so cool. And the cool thing that I like about the menu is not only does it give you the checklist of who it is, who you could possibly get, but they are specific to the one you get. So the back is the exact one that you got. It's not just a checklist that is generic for every box, which I really like. I think that that's like a step above what companies have to do. And the fact that they went through the effort to do that is kind of amazing to me. So I'll show you Baby Box, who is such a cutie. Um, this is her little cat bed with balls of yarn and here she is in it. Baby Box is made with toilet paper rolls um, as her hands and legs. She's got a plastic cup as her skirt and then like a milk carton as her head and um, what are those called? Fuzzy wire things? Pipe cleaners. Pipe cleaners um, as her whiskers. You are coming real close to me. Hi. Um, so that is the Gabby's dollhouse item, which I mean, I know that it's for loin fruit, but it's so like, I just really like the Gabby's dollhouse items. Gabby's dollhouse is such a cute show. It's about a girl that like makes all these toys from things that she can find around the house. Um, there are some surprise items. Oh, and some stickers. Spooky as heck. Look at how cute that is. And I'm pretty sure that this is ah, shady pizza this is so exciting I cannot with how cute these stickers are and I'm gonna put them on my water bottle I have my very fancy expensive white water bottle that I put all of my favorite stickers on I bought this water bottle just for stickers because I don't know what else people put their stickers on and I'm not one of those crazy people that just like can put stickers on anything okay so here is, um, here is, oh, these are the box bus cats. Oh my goodness. I've never seen them. They're so detailed. There's a little driver on the inside wearing a green driver's hat. And this is like a corgi, like a, maybe a corgi, no, like what's the Japanese Akita maybe? Um, dog and I don't I don't read Japanese so I don't know what it says up there. Shiba Inu? Shiba Inu like maybe a Shiba Inu. Aren't Shiba Inus like Korean? Um this one is a hippo. Oh my gosh it's so cute. It's got such a cute hippo face and like a hippo body. There's a little seat and like the hippo driver and the hippo has a little hippo hat which I'm obsessed with. Very very cute. Um and then this one is a fancy poodle 
with a um, red and uh, white striped chair and the fancy poodle has a little fancy poodle hat on too. These are really adorable. I'm so excited. I'm just having the best time. <gasps> There's a little Tsum Tsum's candy dispenser. So adorable with Mickey and Minnie. And it's dispensing gumballs. Not Tsum Tsum's guys, it's gumballs. <laughs> gumballs, which is so cute. Um, oh, I'm really excited about the Sandy Hot Wheels. SpongeBob SquarePants Sandy Hot Wheels. I'm still on the lookout for the SpongeBob, which you can see right there. So adorable. I should have gotten it the last time I saw it, but I was like, I don't know. And now I'm like, I do know. Um, a little Donut Saurus uh, air freshener that smells like donuts. Very cool. And a Hell Yeah bag, which is so cute. And it's got liquid in there with little lightning bolt confetti. Um, I got two Num Noms dippers that I'm not going to open right now. And then two of these um, Sniffy Bugs insect perfumes, which I'm not going to open right now. They look really cute, but I'll open them in a separate video because this video is getting really long. And unopened Pick Me Pops, which is such a cute one. I don't have, I've never opened a brand new Pick Me Pop and I'm excited. And then these I think are the unicorn babies. Yes, they're the unicorn babies. I will open these in a different one too because they are sealed other than finding out what the baby is, but these are so cute. Also confusingly, oh no, it's not an empty back head. There's like a uh, hair that goes in it. But I'll open it in, a, in another one because this one is sealed and we're like going on 12 minutes. I'm so sorry, husband's holding, he's my tripod right now. But I do wanna say thank you so much, Maggie. It has been so fun seeing you. Like this is the second time I've met you in person and you are such an amazing human and I always enjoy seeing you in person and hanging out with you and uh, sharing the toy joy and so much more. And so thank you, thank you, thank you. And I hope everybody's having a wonderful day and having so much toy joy and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.